Hello and welcome here. House of the Dragon is once more the subject of rumors that Elizabeth Olsen will appear in its second season. It is widely believed that Elizabeth Olsen will play the younger version of a well-known Game of Thrones character. She previously tried out for the part of Daenerys Targaryen. The actress is reportedly being considered for the young Melisandre part, although nothing has been verified as of yet. In contrast to other programs, House of the Dragon consistently displays growth in its viewership. It may end up becoming the biggest show in HBO's history after being the biggest series to debut on HBO and HBO Max. Elizabeth Olsen may have been contacted about being cast in the show's second season according to insiders. About Game of Thrones, Olsen described the audition as being the most uncomfortable she had ever experienced because she had to read the monologue in two different accents. She said that she auditioned for Khaleesi. The audition was the most uncomfortable she had ever been in. She claimed in her interview with Vulture that she had to imitate the speech that Khaleesi gave in front of a large crowd about how she was their queen. She added that the producers weren't sure whether to go with a British accent or not, so she performed in both. The WandaVision star expressed her admiration for the show and said that she is a die-hard Game of Thrones devotee. She also mentions that the actor who played Jon Snow in the television series, Kit Harington, is constantly on her mind. Olsen can still participate in Game of Thrones spin-off, House of the Dragon, even if she might not have been able to land the character. Regarding the character she will play in the series, there is no clear information or confirmation. But as usual, there are numerous conjectures. Young Melisandre can presumably be played by Elizabeth Olsen in Season 2. The Red Priestess Melisandre, often known as the Red Woman or Red Witch, was allegedly close to King Stannis Baratheon and was also a Red Priestess. It appears that Melisandre is the sole character who can enable a House of the Dragon in Game of Thrones crossover. When Melisandre takes off her necklace in Game of Thrones, she looks to be an aged woman. Without her necklace, she appeared to be considerably older than she appeared on film. She was undoubtedly older than the average person is anticipated to live. Although it was difficult to tell by looking at her, co-creator David Benioff claims that the character is several centuries old. Game of Thrones House of the Dragon takes place roughly 200 years prior. It may be intriguing to draw connections between the two programs, and Melisandre, a witch and a young priestess, may end up making an appearance in House of the Dragon's second season. Elizabeth Olsen may be a good fit for the part because she previously played the Scarlet Witch in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Their names are also practically identical as one is Red Witch, while the other is Scarlet Witch, which also means Red Witch. Fans are excited to have Olsen in yet another successful property as the reports of the Marvel star joining the Game of Thrones prequel spread like wildfire. It would be a missed opportunity for HBO to not cast Elizabeth Olsen in the second season of House of the Dragon given that she is currently one of the most sought after actors in the business. Please like this video and subscribe to my channel. See you soon.